Welcome everyone. Assalamu alaikum everyone. I Sadia Sharmin, Publicity Coordinator of IEEE Computer Society Bangladesh Chapter. Welcome you all for joining this webinar titled Higher Studies in USA, MS or PhD from Zero to Infinity. This webinar has been organized by IEEE CS BTC Team Spark in association with IEEE Computer Society Bangladesh Chapter for providing you the opportunity to educate yourself about how to pursue higher education in the United States. In this webinar, the speaker will discuss the whole process from application preparation to post application activities of getting admission to the university in USA. Let me introduce our speaker. Shopnil Shayan Shaha, he is a second year MS and PhD student and graduate research assistant at the Network and Embedded System Laboratory in the Department of Electrical and Computer Engineering, University of California, Los Angeles. He has completed his BSc in Electrical and Electrical Electronic Engineering with the highest distinction and double dissertation from the University of Dhaka in 2019. He has also received advanced training with excellent student hours in small satellite engineering from Shanghai Chiao Tong University, Beihang University, and Middle East Technical University. He joined UCLA in 2019 on Regents Fellowship. Uh, his research interests included applied machine learning, embedded system design, mobile health, wearable computing, and human computer interaction. Till now, he has two journal articles, one book chapter and 13 conference article. He has also received 35 hours in national and international technical robotics or business competitions with several completed projects and grants. He has also been involved with the Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineer at, the, at an international level and was the winner of 2018 IEEE Richard Marvin Squalor. Now I request Shopnil Shan Shaha to start the session. Thank you, Sadia Apu. Uh, can can everyone see my screen? Can you see screen? Yes, yes, it's visible. Okay, that's good, yeah. So, I mean, it's going to be a pretty interactive session. So I may request Kaur Bharki, Jodhya Pantar Kona Koshnas Take again like just you know speak up one by one but as i'm like going through so that'll be good and yeah sorry for the delay there was like a little problem with the zoom thing so i mean anyway let's like start so yeah i mean sadia book gave a nice introduction about me so i'm sapnil and i mean last year 2019 i joined ucla as a regents fellow and currently i mean network embedded systems lab a graduate student researcher and if you look at the logo at the bottom, so we proudly say that UCLA is like, you know, the inventor of the internet. Okay. So a little about UCLA and LA. So UCLA is ranked the number one public university in the US and it's considered a public ID by the US News and World Report. And this has been going on since 2017. And nationally, we're currently ranked 20. And globally, we're always ranked within the top 40. Like currently we're, 36th on the QS ranking, 15th on Times Higher Education, and 14th in the US News and World Report. And I mean, I'm just the Bangladesh Shanghai compared to it, then UCLA is sort of a lot like, you know, like Jodi Dhaka University perfect with Tonic Tarakum because like both of them started at the same time, both are 100 years old and both have a huge number of student body. And on a key, like, I mean, Jahan friends in me, she said that they're like, I have a lot of seniors so from Bangladesh and to come to UCLA and the first thing is, oh, wow, this looks a lot like, you know, Garzon Hall and sort of like that. And yeah, that sounds more or less right because UCLA students are pretty proud about themselves, you know, being the number one public university. So like, really relevant, like, you know, we as Bangladeshis, when you go to a certain place, it takes a long time to adapt. But in general, the city got authority, Los Angeles and Los Angeles is situated in California. So 
both of you know this city and this state they are pretty culturally vibrant and accepting like since california is more or less you know sort of like center left when it comes to politics so they tend to like accept people from various races like on a conservative states as you said like if you go there and until the last day happen then you know people are not going to take it well but that's not the same thing you know in in multicultural cities like LA or california so like regardless of your religion gender like LA is pretty accepting and like there's something for everyone here and one of the most difficult things that is obviously that faces all knowledge is, is like usa has a pretty diverse weather and some of the states are pretty harsh and some of the states are pretty comfortable so california weather in general i mean southern california weather is pretty like european and it's extremely perfect like year round there's like 25 degrees celsius warm weather that's why she was from the আমাদের <laughs> 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 like another serious issue is like on showing you know you guys may have seen posts that i'm the mangashi khabar miss got to see where missing fuchka chot putty etc etc but like after i came here I, i did not face any sort of issues with food because la has a pretty big bengali community and there's the existence of little ones so it's, it's it's pretty easy to you know taste or get whatever you want if you want to cook something then you know if it requires like special stuff from another she can easily get it in little bangladesh that's a good thing like you know big cities they have their own maladishi diaspora so that's a pretty good thing and obviously la is the entertainment capital of the world like there's a lot of scope for you know exploring the arts exploring you know films music and those sort of stuff as well so i mean sadia was given a good introduction about me so i'll not go into the details so i joined usl last year on regions fellowship and currently i'm a gsr and these are some of my current research interests so since i'm in a systems lab so more or less our maximum kaj gulo ei beshi interdisciplinary for example i work with machine learning then obviously machine learning run korar jonno je iot go sensor not dorkar i also design those and information ke you know how to present information in new ways to human so i also work on those stuff as well so it's pretty interdisciplinary that may be one thing Are they aware of that? I can make you one of the co-hosts. Make co-host. Okay. On a on a jaga the the first time I mute court is not so I think you guys can control that once you are like co-host and host. Anyways. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, I mean, I work in a pretty interdisciplinary area uh, consisting of IoT, machine learning and everything. So, since we're systems lab, we have to deal with, you know, making the end product out. So, I want to lab on a Christian issue, cyber security, cyber physical systems, then IoT, ML, and I work with hardware as well. So, yeah. And so that was already told about my publications, which is fine. And I graduated last year from Triple D U. Like I get my BSc and the, then I directly came here without a master's. And yeah, more or less, I mean, apart from my academic profile, I mean, I love doing music a lot and I love being on stage. And like since I was brought up, you know, in like the core part of Dhaka, so I also love the nightlife. And LA was like pretty self-exploratory choice for me. Anyway, so I divided the presentation into three sections. So firstly I am like budge like how to do it from scratch which is what I have what I wanted to focus on because a lot of presentations just focus on you know like list of stuff that you need to do but that's more or less available online so this section will more focus on you know like how to build your you know profile when you are you know maybe starting your university or something so yeah 
So, a common question that I'm always face query, like, how do you get a high CGPA, you know, in Bangladesh? And, you know, like, a lot of universities have a lot of different grading systems and criteria, so it'll be hard to, like, cover everything. But more or less, the general, you know, idea is that you need to know how to work intelligent and don't just, you know, work hard. I mean, I know a lot of, of, of my batchmates who used to like study, you know, 10 to 12 hours per day, but essentially, I mean, I'm out of point this morning because, I mean, at the end of the day, what you need to do is in bed, you just need to, you know, get used to the system because all of these universities have, you know, a certain set of patterns that, it, that they try to follow. And if you just get used to that, then you'll be more or less fine. So the first thing that you need to do is you need to identify the patterns in the course that you are going to take. And to do that, you can usually use past resources or you can just add in the classes. So you can look like, okay, so in this particular course, Professor Kirokam question for an exam. So you can try to identify those. And one thing that I always followed is like, since I came from an English medium background, I was not used to, you know, memorizing loads of stuff. And we all know that my mother she show university motivation of the show, you know, memorization of focus. So what I followed was I tried to like study less, but whatever I studied, I tried to like learn that well. So this is sort of like taking a calculated risk since you are not like studying everything. There's a chance to do a particular topic things on your then you know you'll have problems. So it depends from course to course. Like in Hag University in my department, like in the finals, we had we had we could like choose which questions to answer, like for example, four out of six or something like that. So it's all about taking, you know, calculated risks. So yeah, more or less data summary of this slide is like, instead of trying to absorb everything, like obviously you'll have lots of courses. So try to learn, you know, whatever you study, try to learn learn it well. So that you can get your questions, then you can answer it readily. Uh, good evening. Uh, I am Thanks for pointing out. Okay, so yeah, so as I was saying, like what we need to do is we need to identify the patterns based on past resources and we need to take calculated risks. That is, we want to learn whatever we study instead of trying to just memorize all of this stuff. And basically we need to get used to the system. That is like the, you know, number one thing. The next question comes, okay, Bahaya, like I'm a CGP of hello, but how am I going to a lot time to my ECS? So like we have a common misconception misconception in Bangladesh that if you want to do ECS, you have to do lots of different stuff that is not even related to your talent or something, but that is not in general true. So what these universities want to see is that okay, you are doing a certain ECA, maybe you know, you are good at music or maybe you are good at photography or maybe you have you know like a natural talent in a particular subject for example maths so they will not you know like if you have more ECS that are you know that come from diverse backgrounds that is not always a good thing so what universities want is that okay we're doing something like what's the proof that you are good at it like they will want proof of excellence for example if you are good at math probably you'd want to participate in math olympiads that's one thing so proof of excellence is important and in the US what I've observed is like people are pretty competitive and like they tend to not value second place that much. So you have to try to be the best in whatever you do. Like if you love doing robotics, then you know, try to go out in some competitions, you know, win some awards and then you know show them that okay, yeah, you are worthy as well. So there should be a proof of excellence and you should obviously try to the best at it. And to do that, you need focus. Like if you are trying to like I mean, the extra the on the focus code to try and then it's not going to work pretty well for you. And most importantly, whatever you do, your ECS should have a purpose and it should be relevant 
to like your your future goals. I mean, obviously there I mean, there's no harm in making a hobby as a ECA, but when we're applying, you should be able to like tell the admissions committee, okay, I did this, I got these awards, and then why I did that, and how is it relevant to my future career? Okay. So up next comes work experience. So work experience is pretty different from ECA. I mean, what ECA essentially does is it tries to you know extend your intelligence and creativity beyond your academic you know standards. And work experience is about applying you know a combination of your ECA skills and your academics into the real world. So there are a few things that I'm showing sure bully to my participants that a lot of participants tend to think that if we're working for example two years or three years or maybe five years in a company then that is you know much more superior than you know probably an intern or something but that is not true like if you see the cv of people who come from the us you are going to see that rather than you know telling that okay i worked for 10 years in this company they said that like I have achieved this particular, you know, milestones for this particular company. So instead of focusing on the service length and position, it's important to focus on like what are the stuff that you get back to the company. And as I was saying, like is like work experience is a combination of the skills that you learn from the ECS as well as your academics. So that is essentially what is summarized in this slide: that your work experience plus whatever you learn from the academics and ECA. I mean, it it indicates whether you are ready for your career, and that career might be grad school. So that's why I was saying that ECS need to be relevant because if they're not relevant, they will probably not be useful to you in the future. So, a portion of Karagono questions, that's it. If you have questions, you can unmute and ask me. Okay, I guess Carol can all questions now, so we can continue. Okay, so the next most important thing is if you want to come to grad school, you should be able to do research. And the hardest part in doing research in Bangladesh is like trying to formulate a problem. Because since Bangladesh is to resources now, so we really cannot compete with the you know big labs from UCLA or something. So like what sort of ideas should we look at and still be able to publish? So what I always tell is that when you're trying to find a problem, what you have to do is humanize the problem. So what do you mean by humanize? So humanize means that you have to try to look for a problem that connects to you know maybe some of your frustrations or some of society's frustration, regardless of what discipline you come from. Upon humanize both, it doesn't, necessarily mean that it has to directly impact the society, but it has to have some improvements over, you know, some existing methods that are being unable to solve a problem. For example, suppose that, uh, like in 2017, like in 2017, they like formalin issued an AI, like, you know, everyone was pretty concerned and it came out in the news. And then I was thinking, okay, like, what if we could make like an intelligent formalin detector? Like that might be a good product. So this sort of stuff, you know, like really helps to push your, you know, publications forward because you, you would like actually have real data that, okay, like this is the problem and this is what I'm trying to solve. And there's like, you know, a good demand for it. So that is what is known by humanizing. So in order to get like an idea for a paper, so essentially what the easiest way to approach a paper is to look at problems around you. So there are three key things to formulate the idea for research you have to combine the head the hand and the heart so essentially what this means you have to have you know the logic you need your dedication and hard work and the heart it essentially means that you have to balance your you know logic with you know emotions and stuff like that and to start as i said that you have to look for problems in your society and one way to do that is to follow this chart shown in the bottom right so firstly, you can list your frustrations in various fields. For example, you might see that there's a particular problem in the way that professors are delivering lectures during the pandemic. So maybe that might be a frustration. And then you have to like interview, you know, probable clients or, you know, if a test subject is just a society, then you could, you know, pick up random members 
of the public and then you could start talking about that particular problem with them like do you need help or like did you feel that this issue is also something that you're facing and then you could you know do a formal market research so obviously i mean market research is a pretty big term so essentially it means that taking interviews of people and then you know going through literature and finding out okay if this is a problem worth it to do research or not so as i said that the hardest part is finding the idea and in our okay how can i get the recorded session afterwards okay yeah i think i typically will upload it to youtube so i'll share the recording file with that typically okay anyway so in order to find a particular problem i mean before you do that you have to focus on a specific area so that is also a pretty hard part like i mean kon area the research go and i think a re research supervisor or you know like maybe your courses might come into play like into telling you like okay what sort of area am i expert in like if you are trying to work in an area that doesn't really expert doesn't really allows you then you are obviously not going to love doing research so it's pretty important to try and focus on a specific area and see like instead of like onake research kare jeta dekhi je like they to try to see like what are the current hot topics and stuff like for example machine learning ne onake la hoy jese ekhon recently reinforcement learning ne onek love chabe jese but if you are not comfortable with the math and everything then you are not going to love doing research in these areas so it's important to like focus on a specific area but i mean not in the way that what the market what wants it's about what you want like what you think that you are going to shine in and as i've already said that it's best i mean easiest to focus on the current trends like what are the current problems and stuff that's going on and then you can start formulating an idea based on the you know existing literature and stuff and often when you're formulating idea i often use this chart to show whether the idea is a good fit and whether it has a potential or not so I, an idea might not be a good fit for the society but it might have you know ground breaking potential but that's not good so if you look at you know the best papers from itbl and sam you're going to see that they have a pretty good storyline that they show that okay like this is the problem and these are the existing stuff and they don't solve the problem and we're trying to solve this you know probably using less resources or by improving the accuracy to this much amount so whatever solution you are coming up with it has to be it has to have a potential but it also should fit the specific area as well as you know the problem that you're trying to solve so i have listed a couple of documents that i have collected over the years so i can start and you know maybe take a look at those documents so firstly a note on research methodology this is by my ex supervisor professor atigur rahman ahad so i am going to share all these docs and link everything at the end of the presentation so essentially you will be able to like in uh, shopil sir in this session uh, professor atik is also present and he he is also hearing your talk oh that's nice that's good to hear Okay. Yeah, I actually learned a lot of research from him. So whenever I go to, you know, any talks or anything, I try to show this, you know, particular handout that I always keep in mind, like simple notes on research issues. So I, at the end of the, you know, presentation, maybe you can take a look at this. And Professor Ahad has also shared the latest, I guess, videos for this. Thanks. Okay. Uh, we have a few questions, I guess. If the lecture is given in Bangla, it will be easier. Okay, I mean you can talk in Bengali because there are no foreign participants. Uh, it, uh, it it will be very easier for our participant actually. Okay, sure. Uh, okay, you okay. Can, you can share ah. in Bengali, no problem, please. अच्छा ठीक है सर तो शेयर करो। हमारे बांग्ला जो तो और थोड़ा भालू ना, but I'll try my best. So I guess there was a question, like John question course. So let me see what that question is. So. is research equally important for both ms and phd persuaders so the answer is like apni joto beshi korte parben i mean us application process holistic so it takes into account a lot of factors and joto beshi apni sell korte parben nijeke the better so in at least in usla ami jeta dekhi like there are two types of masters basically three types of masters but two types is important for us so first hot shape page so what kind of going to finding nahi and the second is an ms leading to phd so that is thesis based so if you are going for the thesis based masters othoba apni funding chan then obviously you need to do research because you will need to find a professor who is willing to fund you 
and so if you don't have good research background then obviously with professor apnake choose na kore onno kauke choose korbe so it's best to have like you know safety from all directions so even if you if you are applying for masters apnar jodi funding er somoshya na thake then it's fine you don't need to do that much research but if you're looking for funding during the ms then obviously yeah you have to look, you have to do research okay so moving forward to so, ami ekta document already dekhailam and not on research methodology so after the presentation you can now take a look at it and then the next document is avoiding bad journals so eta khub beshi important so i'll just go through all this uh, this one a bit because ami onek shomoy khyal kori facebook e oneke post dicche je ekta particular okay aro question ache okay ami ei slide ta shesh kore den question answer kortechi so oneke ei jiggesh kore je ekta particular journal ache so that journal is paid or something and Three to four weeks of review, kore dite and publish kore fels and you know, je publish kore she kuch happy. But before doing all of this, he or she needs to look at whether the journal is predatory or not. So what do we mean by predatory? So predatory journal hotshe je journal gulo like kono quality maintain kora na, like other kono bhalo review nai, ukhane just taka the je kuch publish korte hobe. So a type of journal thagar thake na thagai bhalo because this is going to have like a negative. Impact about you, like professor. Jokon dek baje apna particular hoy journal le naam asse apna CV the. Then she onik kisu assume kora ni to par apna par. So it's best to avoid these sort of journals and start looking at you know the ones that are like genuine. So for engineers, for example, amra I T P L and S M L journal le onik beshi publish kori, you know journals and conferences, whatever comes. So here are a couple of points. So you can look at all of these points, you know, after the presentation. And Arakta on next time I question that I may pay. Je on next time I university theke o journal publish kore. But trust me, banana deshe university actually ekono journal publish kora moto porja jane ni jete. So it's better to stick to reputed publishers. So here are a few lists: Citibank, Springer, Elsevier, SEM, Teller and Francis, etc. And this is the most important thing that Arakta has taught me that. पेपर and i also have a folder jekhane you can find all of my research papers so you can take a look at all of those after that so what this will essentially teach you is like how you know my writing style changed over the years and how i tried to focus on specific issues so for example this was like my first paper when i was you know a kid so tokhon amar lekha oto bhalo chilo na and i didn't know like how to do proper research so this is not like a pretty good paper but after that like if i look at you know 2018 2019 jokhon ami ahat sarer sathe join korlam then my you know paper started to become more serious so then i started to you know work on machine learning you know compete with you know rest of the state of the art in the field and stuff like that so you can look at it later and then you know if you have questions you can comment so there was a question earlier i guess nowadays is it possible to get fund in ms in us okay that's a good question so it's very hard to get funding purely from ms so should the ms actually kono professor you fund dite chay na because professors are looking for long term commitment so but funding power is easier hocche masters leading to phd the so like if you want to for example do research as well as continue your masters like i am doing then there is a chance that up the funding paben but jodi pure masters koren then it's very hard to manage funding i guess there's another question now this is because phd needs huge effort and yeah i know phd needs a huge effort and time but that's like sort of the bitter truth that unless you're going to like erasmus wonders in europe or something then must pure master se fund power take to difficult hoye jay shor jonno ei jonno amra jeta kori like amra onekei phd te apply kori but since amader bachelor's kora nai we get into the master's program and then we you know আমরা কোর্স করি আমরা রিসার্চ করি উই মেক প্রফেসর হ্যাপি এন্ড দেন যদি আমাদের 
মনে হয় যে আর ভালো লাগতেছে না দেন উই জাস্ট লিভ বাট দ্যাট ইজ নট ইথিক্যাল ইন দি এন্ড এজ ওয়েল বাট ইয়া ওভারঅল আই মিন দ্যাট ইজ দ্য সিচুয়েশন লাইক ইওর মাস্টার সে ফান পাওয়া ইজ ভেরি ডিফিকাল্ট ওকে নাও দিস আফটার এমএস আই ওয়ান্ট টু সুইচ টু আ জব ওকে আই মিন ইয়া আই মিন আমি জানি স্কেল করছি যারা লাইক ইন্ডিয়া থেকে अप्लाई করে তারা ম্যাক্সিমাম পিএইচডি তে अप्लाई করে না সো ওরা মাস্টার্স এ अप्लाई করে এন্ড দেন মাস্টার্স এ अप्लाई করার পর ওরা খুব ইজিলি টপ কোম্পানিজ এ জব পেয়ে যায় সো ওটা খুব কঠিন কিছু না লাইক ইফ ইউ ওয়ান্ট টু ডু জব দেন ইয়া ডিয়ার স্পিকার মাই সাজেশন ওকে ইয়া উই ক্যান ডু দ্য কিউ এট দি এন্ড ওকে সো হ্যাঁ তো আমি যেটা বলতেছিলাম যে ইটস বেস্ট টু হ্যাভ লাইক ইউ নো ওয়ান গুড পেপার দেন হ্যাভিং multiple crap papers and you can take a look at all those uh, resources that i gave here later on and then read, read and find out yourself so on a now the question is ami kibhabe bhalo conference ba bhalo journal bujhbo so i already told you kibhabe bhalo journal bujhte chai there are list of reputed publishers and for good conferences in your body it's best to publish with professional bodies for example in case of you know computer scientists and electrical engineers so amra it boli ba sm e publish korte beshi আমি সবাই জানি এখন যেটা হচ্ছে যে ইভেন টপ টপ কনফারেন্স গুলো তাদের রেজিস্ট্রেশন ফ্রি করে দিচ্ছে So, we have to do at least if we cannot publish, we have to do at least conference goal that we have to do the key type of work and the key type of work and the key type of work. And the question that we have to ask is how to download the paper and download the paper. So, I don't have to give it a slide, but I guess it's all right. I guess I have to give it a paper and download the paper, but it's illegal, so I don't have to do it. But, you know, since we are from a developing country, so... জানে আমেরিকাও জানে যে আমরা সাইহাব থেকে পেপার নামাই বাট দে ডোন্ট বেসিক্যালি কেয়ার অ্যান্ড দি মোস্ট ইম্পর্টেন্ট থিং দ্যাট আমি যেটা দেখি যে লাইক আ লট অফ পিপল হ্যাজ আ লট অফ কোয়েশ্চেন্স বাট আই মিন ডুইং রিসার্চ ইউ হ্যাভ টু লার্ন হাউ টু লুক ফর পেপারস অ্যান্ড ইউজুয়ালি মানুষ গুগল স্কলারে পেপার খোঁজে সো ইট উড বি বেস্ট ইফ ইউ উড লার্ন হাউ টু বি নো গুগল প্রপারলি লাইক গুগলকে যদি ঠিকমতো ইউজ করতে না পারেন দেন ইট উড বি ভেরি হার্ড টু ফাইন্ড হোয়াট ইউ আর লুকিং ফর অনেক সময় ইউ নো like when you are writing a paper apnar ka eta certain point hoyto prove korte hoyte pare and for that you need a certain paper and if you don't know how to google it properly then it will be very difficult for you to find that paper so in summary like whatever i have said so far ami jodi recap kori so in order to do research you have to first identify a problem and to identify a problem you have to look into the society or you know you have to look into the existing literature body and as i said and as i said the easiest way to do it is to like take interviews or check for existing solutions and the news they like the but apni current papers they like the but in our field and the key thing is to find small weaknesses in the existing solution ekta jinish jeta ami always boli je paper je 100% novel hobe eta true na paper ta hocche apnar it's like a small bump so it's going to you know make small steps towards progress so existing the hoyto onek gulo weakness thakte pare apnar kono ekta particular problem so you focus on one problem and try to find the solution to that and then you propose your idea and then you start doing experiments and one very important thing that i would like to stress is like i mean onek paper dekhi bangladesh theke and us the bangladeshi author their reputation khubi kharab sadly because they don't know how to write papers properly that the proper baseline thake na and they just try to you know hoyto kichu data ase কিছু মেশিন লার্নিং করলাম এন্ড পেপার হয়ে গেল বাট দ্যাট ইজ নট ট্রু সো ইউ হ্যাভ টু হ্যাভ লাইক গুড এক্সপেরিমেন্টাল ব্যাক আপ ইউ হ্যাভ টু শো দ্যাট যে এগুলো হচ্ছে স্টেট অফ দি আর্ট এন্ড স্টেট অফ দি আর্টের তুলনায় এটা হচ্ছে আমার ইউ নো প্রপোজ আইডিয়াল পারফরমেন্স অর স্টাফ লাইক দ্যাট এন্ড অনেক সময় যেটা করতে পারেন আপনি যে এক্সপেরিমেন্টাল স্টেট যে অবভিয়াসলি আমরা সবাই দুর্বল মরলে সো এই ক্ষেত্রে এক্সপার্ট অপিনিয়ন ইজ ভেরি ইম্পর্টেন্ট অ্যান্ড দেন ইউ ক্যান ইউ নো স্টার্ট অ্যাটেন্ডিং ইন ওয়েবিনার্স কনফারেন্সেস কম্পিটিশনস তো এইসব জায়গায় আসলে ইভেন্ট অ্যাটেন্ড করাটা খুব ইম্পর্টেন্ট হয়ে দাঁড়ায় ইন অর টু ফর্মালিটি আইডিয়া পিটি ওয়ার্ক 
So after you receive expert opinion, then you try to reformulate your idea, you try to reformat your experiments, and then you go for publications. Okay. And Arakta Genius Jeta Ami Bolvo, Jeta, you are going to find in the docs anyway. Je, on a key multiple conference by Jayanala Summit for the chat, but that is not allowed. You are only allowed to submit in one place at a time. And after publication, like when you have pub publications, finally, in you know, the two or three publications, then you can combine all of these ideas and then up to pitch for an idea to, you know, as a proposal or to you know, investors and stuff like that. I have a document called How to Present in Competitions. So Bangladesh is a problem which we are very bad in presentations. So you can take a look at that and try to see like how to present in large competitions in front of maybe you know, 500, 600 students. The next important thing that comes in our mind is obviously, let me look at some of the questions to see if they're relevant or not. Uh, is it possible to directly apply for PhD without doing MSc? Yes, that's exactly what I did. So that's not a problem. Could you please provide us with the bad journal PDF? Yeah, and I'll share everything. No worries. Completing Masters for Bangladesh. Can anyone, can anyone help for, uh, I'm not sure I got uh, that question. Anyway, is it preferable to apply for PhD along with MSc? That is called MSc leading to PhD. Uh, the answer is, I mean, it depends on you, but I would say yes, because you can MSc leading to PhD got passion, then you'll be able to do a lot of courses and you'll be able to learn a lot. So that's important. If I want a paper with second or third authorship in a reported journal, should I mention? Yeah, obviously. I mean, even if you are like the last, last author, if it's a good journal, you should mention. And Ahatsar has already shared some points. That is good. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Some of the questions are private, so I mean, privately answered the Okay. Anyway. Uh, so next important genie should say obviously like okay upon up not ECS Tigase, you have good work experience, you have good, you know, GPA. I only have to sit for the tests. So GRE and TOEFL. So I'm Kubishi data sa Javana because I have a separate PDF for cracking the GRE. You can take a look at that. And I'll also share the GRE materials that I used during my prep. So Shagulo the Kli Mother. But in short summary, GRE you know, it's a computer based test. So it's like admission test. But since GRE is general or a you know a particular discipline like issue test corona, they're going to basically test your you know critical analytical skills and after, you know mathematical skills skill. So GRE is basically divided into three parts. There is the essay part, then there's the verbal reasoning part. They kind of they test you out on, you know, fill in the blanks and then comprehension and stuff like that. And lastly, there's the maths. And GRE is graded out of 340 and the essay is graded out of six. So two important question what says the GRE divo. So I'm just always recommend for It's best to give the GRE when you are in, you know, at the end of your third year or when you are, you know, at the start of your fourth year. Because so, so, so normally I mean it depends on person to person, but usually two to three months after GRE prep could easily But you can see it's for you know slow long term prep. So it has a charm share. Uh, so, I was going to course in the first day, I mean, first time I math skill, although I'm an engineer, so I tried to solve Nova's Math Bible. So, Nova Math Bible is like the one of the hardest, like, GRE math books out there. So, it has already solved the problem, then, you know, everything is more or less fine. Then, words, I mean, I was going to I mean, I was thousand words for Silam, and I revised those words every day till the end of the exam. Otherwise, obviously, I mean, what was the Plus, if you are a little weaker in English, you might also consider looking at sad words. A material shall be pavan, so nothing to worry. And then you can complete the Manhattan in you know, 1 to 6 and 7, 8 if you want, but it will actually could be elementary level. I always recommend Kuri, try to complete Manhattan five point, like top to bottom. Like try to solve it yourself. But it's important to you know have the words in mind plus all the matrix before you try to solve this. And then just test it one of the Nagi, you can just practice the SS and you can see it for the mocks. And mock tests, I mean, I'm going to pay tested. I mean, GRE coaching, but 
আপনার central best but ওটা যদি না পান তো প্রবলেম নেই লাইক देयर इज लाइक डीएनएस সফট ইউ সফট ইউ ক্যান ট্রাই দোস আমি যেমন টফেল ইউ সফট দিস ইলম এন্ড ইউ সফট ইজ কনসিডার ওয়ান অফ দ্য ওয়ার্স্ট বাট আমার সাম সমস্যা নেই খুব বেশি এন্ড দিস স্লাইড অলসো হ্যাজ লিংকস টু টফেল মক্স ইউ ক্যান ডাউনলোড ফ্রি টিপু মক্স ফ্রম দিস লিংক এন্ড নাও টু ইউ নো গো থ্রু ইউ নো লাইক হাউ টু ক্র্যাক দ্য টফেল আ বিট সো ফর দ্য জিআর ইউ ক্যান জাস্ট লুক এট দ্যাট পার্টিকুলার পিডিএফ এন্ড ইউ ক্যান গেট ডিটেইল টিপস এন্ড ফর টফেল লাইক ইউ ক্যান ফলো অল দিস স্টাফ সো ফর एग्जांपल ফর স্পিকিং so speaking obviously amader shobari ektu jorota thake since amader karori first language english na so profile speaking actually it's a game of formats next page i'm going to format dekhabo and it's also a game of like you know how good of a note taker you are so profile is jeta apnar speaking hobe je ekta particular issue niye kotha bolbe onake and then apnake seta niye kichu lekha likhi korte hobe so you have to jot down the main points during listening first on a piece of paper so আপনার নোট টেকিং স্কিলসটা এখানে আসলে ইউ নো খুব ইম্পর্টেন্ট যে আপনি এফিসিয়েন্ট নোট টেকার কি না সো এখানে আসলে আপনি যখন ইউনিভার্সিটিতে ক্লাস করবেন তখন যদি তখন থেকে যদি হাতে নোট নেওয়া শুরু করেন তখন আসলে জিনিসটা একটু ভালো করে প্র্যাকটিস হবে আর রিডিং সেকশন নিয়ে যদি বলি জিআর ইর ভারবালের মতো টফেলের কম্প্রিহেনশন খুব বেশি কঠিন না সো জাস্ট পাঁচ মিনিট স্ক্রিন রিডিং করলেই টফেল বিকামস ভেরি ইজি এন্ড টফেলে আপনার মোটামুটি ফিফটিন মিনিটসের মতো দেয় পার section complete kora jeno but 12 minutes is more or less good enough and arekta jinish jeta obviously khub beshi use kori amra seta hocche omitting you know false answers like instead of trying to find out the correct answers we are trying to find out kon answer ta bhul so etar jonno apnake ekta question ke one gulo angle theke dekhte hobe so ei khane apnar gr skills ta jodi you know khub bhalo thake then khub help hobe because gr te ei same jinish apnake korte hobe but aro depth the Like you have to really go into the passage and you know start reading and then looking and for listening listening is also similar to speaking listening you have to note koto bhalo kore nite partasen shatter game so you have to you know try to find out how good of a note taker you are and then comes the essay essay ni ashole ke khub beshi chinta korena because essay is also the same it's a game of formats and you can look up youtube and then find like you know all these essay formats and stuff GL, TOEFL RSA is just you know a lighter version of the GRE essay so it's not that hard and here are some formats for speaking so you can take a look at it after the presentation okay then the most important part i want the pandemic so i want like key job is so about GRE and TOEFL jodi ami boli so on maximum university apnar TOEFL ar GRE optional kore felse but kichu university is recommended so it's best to check with your university and mainly with your department so apni apnar university ba department ke mail diben je আমার টফেল বা জিআই দাও দরকার কিনা তখন তারা আপনাকে বলে দিবে যে whether it's optional or whether it's recommended and আরেকটা ইম্পর্ট্যান্ট কোশ্চেন হচ্ছে যে এখন তো প্যান্ডেমিক সো আমি কিভাবে এখন রিসার্চ করব সামনে যে খেয়াল করছি যে প্যান্ডেমিক হওয়ার সত্ত্বেও কিন্তু অনেকেই পাবলিশ করতেছে খুব ভালো ভালো জায়গায় इवन বাংলাদেশ থেকেও রিসেন্টলি ওকে লাইক আমার জুনিয়র যারা তারা রিসেন্টলি খুব টপ কনফারেন্সে পাবলিশ করছে সো দ্য থিংস দ্যাট আই হ্যাভ সিন লাইক মানুষ যারা করে সো লাইক এখন তো অবভিয়াসলি লাইক ইউ নো হিউজ ল্যাব ল্যাবে যে কাজ করাটা খুব ডিফিকাল্ট সো পিপল আর মুভিং টু লাইক সিমুলেশনস এন্ড সফটওয়্যার সেন্ট্রিক প্রজেক্টস লাইক ফর एग्जांपल মেশিন লার্নিং বা ডিপ লার্নিং ডেটা সায়েন্স বা ইউ নো স্টাফ দ্যাট ক্যান বি ডান অন আ কম্পিউটার সো পিপল আর ট্রাইং টু ডু দ্যাট এন্ড সিন্স ডেটা কালেকশন সম্ভব না পিপল আর ট্রাইং টু ইউজ এক্সিস্টিং ডেটা সেটস টু ফর্মুলেট देयर আইডিয়া সো देयर আর লটস অফ ডেটা সেটস अवेलेबल অনলাইন এন্ড ইউ ক্যান টেক আ লুক এট দেম and i actually if apne jodi hard earn e kaj korte chan then work on something that you can you know implement at home so recently like amar onek colleague hi hard earn e kaj kore so amra shobai bashai jinish niye eshe 
catch what they see. And Bangladesh is obviously I can delivery service as an electronic set. So it's not hard. And the fourth thing that I've seen people do is instead of you know doing all this applied stuff, people go into the maths and theoretical projects for example, optimization and those sort of stuff. So those are also fine. And I had a question of check on the pandemic, I'm a QVC school, like I cannot go out, I cannot go to contests. But the thing is like anything, I mean, universities are gonna apply and they're going to understand this. Like, okay, like there was this pandemic and this particular kid couldn't, you know, go out and get awards and stuff. So they're going to, you know, understand. That's fine. Like ECS should be anything that should be should allow you to like express yourself. So for example, it might be fine arts, it might be electronics and stuff like that, but like something that you know really well and you can express later on. So this is the summary of pre-application. So obviously, yeah, I mean, grades is not the only factor. So after the cube high CGP, like don't think the USF like it's just CGP or best current event. Like the US application process is holistic. So on a factors that kind of play, but as I said, that ECA, work experience, test scores, like all of this stuff come to play. Okay, so now comes the application part, the second part. So it all checked a rough timeline for, you know, higher study, you know, whoever is applying for higher studies. So like the question of Chami Kohon Professor Kucha Shuru Korbo, Kohon University shortlist Korbo. So I'm a university shortlist for a shuru for Silam apply for one year again. That is, I'm a third year at Silam, but I'm a university shortlist for the Silam, like November 2017 to Jan 18. So, like, uh, about the other question, as we shortlist for so what the time I asked the sector for it. Then I'm a GRE Dilam, as I said, by at the start of fourth year, then I give TOEFL. And I mean, I get university shortlist for then Professor Kuja Shuru for C, but it's interchangeable more or less. It depends upon you. So, in my case, I really wanted to, you know, come to LA and California. So I'm a rational university to score a day, which is sensible. So, so Shekhar and I am a professor of university to score for a Kuja Shuru course. And then, you know, I started applying, you know, in late August to early December. So I cannot say, you know, if, if you guys are looking for fall 2021, then this is like the perfect time to start, you know, writing your recipe and the lower than emailing professors and stuff. Okay. And then there were interviews next year, and then the decisions came out in like February to April. So usually US application by April 15th, the month decision And these are some of the results, like for wherever I applied. Like I was rejected to most of the places, obviously, but I got accepted to a couple of places too, like UCLA, UC Santa Barbara, and Rice. So in summary, so the slide that I will tell like what are the key takeaways? So the key takeaway, first key takeaway is you have to plan early. Like I started planning at the end of third year, I was quite sure. So the earlier you plan, the better. Um, then I need to plan to formulate for the And there's this thing that I always said, the elephant rider analogy. So what this means is that like, at a particular university, a lot of factors will come into play. And should you just, you know, logic there, like, okay, I'm a prophet, so I'm a kind of pecker, like a type of, you know, logic. Plus, I need to be overconfident. So, I do a trade off here. I think it's very good. Okay, like I mean, if you apply for it, then probably I should keep like two top universities, maybe, or maybe three safe universities, something like that. So, A analogy today is important. I mean, if you like Bangladesh, you should apply for a professor to apply for it. In particular, in this city, should Bangladesh be able to do it? No, 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 Apply for a professor to contact you, there is a higher chance to, you know, that he is going to interview you and reject your chance to come. But yeah, that doesn't mean that your professor is wrong. I mean, obviously, since I'm not sure what the application fee is, so it's best to find professors and, you know, mail them and then you have an answer plan more or less good, then, you know, it's best to apply. But obviously, you have to reply to that, but you have to apply for a dream to like, don't, you know, just throw it away. And yeah, I have procrastination until the last moment. And it's very important to get a good counselor, like someone who can guide you. So it's best to the Apna University to know senior at Naka Helpata, because other experience as they know the Apna could have like called a Balohabe. So on action, I think it's a profile evaluation request. So it's best to, you know, forward that to your universities because they know like what, you know, standards you went through. So they'll be able to better guide you. And most importantly, like Professor Dasha the Ganzam got a tick now. Ultimately, professor, I have not a lot So it's best to have a good relationship with your professors, friend, you know, professional relationship, maybe such kind of shut up by class current, but try not to, you know, go, you know, class that the Nahoe, Shetak Kelaka, 
ভালো and the most important thing again that comes like research korte you have to learn how to google and same goes here you have to look for universities and professors you have to learn how to google you have to know where to look now the question is am ki bhabe professor khujbo so there are lots of criteria so shobar age je criteria ta mathay ashe seta ranking but ranking alone ashole factor na like apnai jodi apna apnake jeta dekhte hobe je whether you are fit for the city and whether you are fit for the lab or not like অনেক সময় জিনিসগুলোকেশন এই জিনিসগুলো একটু মাথায় রেখে দেন ইউনিভার্সিটি চুজ করা উচিত আর একটা জিনিস যেটা মাথায় রাখা উচিত যে ফান্ডিং বেশি সবচেয়ে কোন ইউনিভার্সিটিতে টপ ইউনিভার্সিটিতে ফান্ডিং বেশি ওয়াই বিকজ অবভিয়াসলি দে আর টপ ইউনিভার্সিটিস দে ডু আ লট অফ রিসার্চ লাইক দে ব্রিং আউট লটস অফ পেপারস সো কিপ সাম বিগ ইউনিভার্সিটিস ইন ইওর লিস্ট बेस्ड অন ইওর প্রোফাইল জাস্ট সবগুলাই সেভ ইউনিভার্সিটি চুজ করাটা ইটস নট আইডিয়াল and to look for professors as i said like there are a couple of ways obviously website ba google korle you know that's like the most common thing that people do but apni jodi like ami age je jekhane bollam je try to attend conference seminars meetings webinars apni jodi shegulo koren onek shomoy i mean with the advent of ieee you know in bangladesh like ieee is organizing lots of conferences and seminars recently so tar onek top top professor ani ashe so hoyto pare je emon hoyto pare je ekta professor asche and you like him and then you send him email and then he did like you which is exactly what happened in my case like i had sir send me to opicom in singapore and then we can i met my professor so it's important to like you know try, try to attend you know all these conferences seminars and meetings and obviously apna professor ba senior theke you can you know get connections like hoyto apna senior kon ekta bhalo professor er under a phd korte se ba apna professor er hoyto collaboration ache then you can start looking at those connections and are ekta common question hocche amake central apply korbo na professor er can not be apply korbo and funding manager har age apply korbo na pore apply korbo i already said about funding je it depends you know on you like apni jodi confident thaken okay like amar ei university dream maybe i should apply and then give a shot so apply korar pore apni professor ke knowledge je ta hobe je ora sort of ekটু committed hoye jabe apnar proti je okay ei chhele ta ba meta apply kore felse so maybe i should take an interview so tokhon your chances of you know getting an increases because you are able to you know get like a one on one interview Otherwise, you know, you can also apply, you know, after managing funding as well, you know, sort of the stuff that we all do, like fund money, like generic reply, you know, but hello reply, you know, whatever we're basically. And Kishu University, they have a central application and Kishu University, they have a professor match for them. So it's best to, you know, check with the university. For example, Stanford is entirely central, whereas UCLA is sort of hybrid. So UCLA, they have a professor can work there, but they have a central application and there are candidates that get in from both. So it depends on the university. Now the question is how to email professors. So do the document can I take a look? So the first is mailing tips. So this was written by my seniors. So you can start, you know, reading after the you know, presentation, you can start reading this and then you can find out like if you have a mail or out to quite a mail or out to the mail or out to the key or out to the key or out to the key. So if you read this, you are going to get a pretty good idea since there's not much time. I'll skip it and you can find my samples emails, you know, within those. folder says also act assembly email me dekhai okay yeah so this is the sample email that i am my professor ke pathaisilam almost 1.5 years ago so i first introduced myself and as you can see like this is how we you know introduce unknown people obviously i am ekhon professor ke amar first i mean first name dhori dakhi but this is the way you you know salute professors who, who you you know don't know then i said that okay i am a final year undergrad i am from this and i wanted to apply and kibhabe i come to let him know me kibhabe chinchi take seta ami ekhane mention korchi and then i started you know talking about all the stuff that i have done like my research and how it you know commutes to his research so this is like the most important you know the body of the paragraph like apni ki research korte chen apnar publications koy ta awards awards ki ki paisen but don't try to don't make it too big like keep it small and then you add us your cv as pdf file and then you know you wait but ha like amar kache jeta hoychilo kono professor reply na nei amake apply korar age so ami apply kore then abar mail korchi tar pore tar amar interview nise 
নেক্সট হচ্ছে সিভি রাইটিং সো अप्लाई করার সময় আপনাকে একটা সিভি দিতে হবে এন্ড অনেক ইউনিভার্সিটি একটা ওয়েবসাইটও চাই সো ইউ ক্যান টেক আ লুক এট মাই সিভি এন্ড देयर इज आल्सो अ ডকুমেন্ট ফর সিভি রাইটিং টিপস ইউ ক্যান টেক আ লুক এট দ্যাট অ্যাজ ওয়েল ইম্পর্ট্যান্ট পার্ট ইজ আপনার লাইক সিভি টা একটু শর্ট রাখবেন লাইক টু পেজ ইজ লাইক দ্য ম্যাক্সিমাম লিমিট আ সিভি শুড বি টু পেজের বেশি হলে কেউ সিভি পড়বে না এন্ড সিভি টা দেখতে সুন্দর হতে হবে এন্ড ইট মাস্ট বি লেজিবল এন্ড ওয়েল অর্গানাইজড ওকে লাইক আমরা অনেকে মাইক্রোসফট ওয়ার্ড এ খুব বাজে ভাবে সিভি টাইপ করে এটা দেখতে একদমই ভালো লাগে না আমি যদিও ওয়ার্ডে বানাইছি বাট देयर আর ওয়েজ টু ইউজ মাইক্রোসফট ওয়ার্ড প্রিটি ওয়েল সো ট্রাই টু সি স্যাম্পল সিভিস এন্ড ট্রাই টু ফলো দ্যাট নাও অ্যাজ দ্য কন্টেন্ট সো হিয়ার আর সাম অফ দ্য লাইক দ্য ইউ নো মোর অর লেস কমন কন্টেন্ট দ্যাট एवरीवन ডাজ লাইক সো এগুলো জাস্ট ফলো করে লিখতে হবে এন্ড ফর ওয়েবসাইট মেকিং ইউ ক্যান ইউজ লাইক অনেক ফ্রি ওয়েবসাইট মেকার আছে উইক্স গুগল সেস উইবলি ইউ ক্যান টেক আ লুক এট মাই ওয়েবসাইট এন্ড সি লাইক আমি কিভাবে ওয়েবসাইট অর্গানাইজ করছি and website er content hocche apnar cv er ekta protracted version hobe like na cv er ekta boro version hobe so try to maintain your website regularly and apart from cv and website try to have a linkedin account skype account google scholar and research gate account so ekula important okay next you have apni apply korar shomoy apnake eta sob obviously likhte hobe so e sob er jonno there's this doc called sob writing tips so this is like pretty useful you can take a look at that afterwards and ekta jinish ami bolbo je apni jokhon sob er likhben এসওপি লেখার আগে আপনি দয়া করে লাইক অন্য কারো এসওপি দেখবেন না বিকজ আপনি যদি অন্য কারো এসওপি দেখেন দেন ইউ কেন বায়াসড সো আপনি যেটা করবেন আপনি আগে নিজে একটা ড্রাফট সাজানোর চেষ্টা করবেন এসওপি সো এখানে কিছু স্যাম্পল কন্টেন্ট আছে যে আপনার লাইফের আলটিমেট গোল কি লাইক আপনার রিসার্চ প্রজেক্ট এক্সপেরিয়েন্স কি এন্ড কোন কোন প্রফেসরের সাথে আপনি কাজ করতে চান সো এসওপি তে যেটা হয় যে জাস্ট একটা পার্টিকুলার প্রফেসর না লাইক অনেকগুলো প্রফেসরের নাম আপনি দিতে পারবেন সো ইউ ক্যান লাইক মেনশন এন্ড দেন ফাইনালি ইউ ল্যান্ড উইথ লাইক একটা পার্টিকুলার ইউনিভার্সিটি তে अप्लाई করছেন দেন ওই ইউনিভার্সিটি তে ঢুকলে আসলে আপনি কি দিতে পারবেন ইউনিভার্সিটি কে দিস ইজ ইম্পর্টেন্ট লাইক অনেকেই লেখে যে এই ইউনিভার্সিটি তে ঢুকলে আমার জীবন ধন্য হয়ে যাবে বাট ইউনিভার্সিটি জীবন ধন্য করার জন্য বসে নাই সো ইটস বেস্ট টু লাইক ইটস অলমোস্ট লাইক আ কোম্পানি যে আপনি কোম্পানি কে কি দিবেন সো ইটস অলমোস্ট লাইক দ্যাট লাইক হাউ উইল ইউ কন্ট্রিবিউট টু দিস পার্টিকুলার ইউনিভার্সিটি अपार्ट फ्रॉम হাউ দ্য ইউনিভার্সিটি হেল্পস ইউ সো দিস ইজ ইম্পর্টেন্ট এন্ড দ্য হার্ডেস্ট পার্ট অফ দ্য এসওপি ইজ আপনি 4 বছরে যা যা করছেন যা যা অ্যাওয়ার্ডস পাইছেন যা যা রিসার্চ করছেন ইউ নো ইউ হ্যাড সাম ওয়ার্ক এক্সপেরিয়েন্স ইউ হ্যাড ইউ নো সাম পেপারস সে সেগুলোকে আপনাকে কানেক্ট করতে হবে সো স্টিভ জবস অলওয়েজ সেড দ্যাট ট্রাই টু কানেক্ট দ্য ডটস ইন ইওর লাইফ সো ইটস সর্ট অফ লাইক দ্যাট যে আপনি লাইফে যা যা করছেন সব কিছুর একটা পারপাস থাকতে হবে রিলেভেন্স থাকতে হবে সো देयर আর লটস অফ ওয়েজ টু ইউ নো মেক স্টোরিজ সো ইফ ইউ ইউ নো লুক এট পেপারস তখন আপনি আস্তে আস্তে বুঝতে পারবেন যে আপনি একটা পেপার পড়তেছেন রিসার্চে দেখলেন যে আরে এই পেপারটা তো তেমন ভালো না বাট পেপারটা কত সুন্দর করে একটা গল্প বলছে সো এস ওবি ইজ অলমোস্ট লাইক দ্যাট হয়তো আপনার লাইফে তেমন কিছু করেন নাই अकॉर्डिंग টু ইউ বাট যদি খুব সুন্দর করে লাইক গুছায় লিখতে পারেন দেন ইট বিকামস লাইক আ রিয়েলি নাইস এস ওবি ড্রাফট এন্ড সাম ইউনিভার্সিটি ইজ অলসো রিকোয়ার আ পার্সোনাল স্টেটমেন্ট দিস ইজ डिफरेंट फ्रॉम দ্য এস ওবি সো পার্সোনাল স্টেটমেন্ট ইজ মোর আর্টিস্টিক সো বেসিক্যালি সেখানে আপনি আপনার লাইফের স্ট্রাগলস আপনার ইউনো ইসিএস নিয়ে একটু বেশি কথা বলবেন কম্পেয়ার টু ইয়োর রিসার্চ So I can show you some SOPs, but I mean, try not to, you know, get, you know, influenced by that. Okay. So I mean, just a first day course, I mean, the code they start course about connecting dots. So this sort of like summarizes whatever I want to, you know, tell in the entire story. Okay. So then I mean, you know, uh, I'm a life at major milestones. Go like, even I ask, should I get a story? I got a. দেখানোর চেষ্টা করছে যে আমি কম্পিউটার সেন্টারেস্টেড ছিলাম দেন আমি ইঞ্জিনিয়ারিং স্কুল চুজ করছি ওভার বেস্ট বিজনেস স্কুল এন্ড স্টাফ দেন আমি আস্তে আস্তে ইউ নো হবি ইলেকট্রনিক্স এন্ড আর্ট এন্ড স্টাফ ওগুলো নিয়ে কাজ করা শুরু করছি দেন কিভাবে ইউ নো আই ট্রিপল ই আমার লাইফে আসলো দেন কিভাবে আমি পেপারস করলাম সেগুলো আর কি আস্তে আস্তে আমি ইউ নো গল্প আকারে বলা শুরু করছি ওকে লাইক ইনস্টেড অফ জাস্ট লিস্টিং দেন আমি এটা করছি এটা আমার পাবলিকেশন এন্ড স্টাফ ইউ হ্যাভ টু টেল ইট লাইক এ স্টোরি সো দ্যাট ইউ নো রিডার্স এট দ্য বোর্ড না হয়ে যায় সো ইউ ক্যান টেক আ লুক এট দিস বাট try not to get influenced from it as i said like nijer sopi lekhar age onnare sopi na dekhai bhalo so try not to do that okay then comes letter of recommendation obviously manaj shira nijer the letter of recommendation nijer ei lekhe maximum but i mean i was quite lucky amar letter of recommendation amar supervisor re likhsilen so one thing that's important to know about letter of recommendation je manaj sher letter of recommendation always khub generic
So this was like one of my advisors. So only kisha focus course then. Only our overall, you know, academics and research near focus course then, and also about my interests. Okay, at acta, and then only a charge on professor. Only focus course then. Our summer camps near. So I mean, satellite engineering. I go there, go there. Get silam. We can't keep keep course. She will have to only focus course then. And the third one. चेने इन्सिडेंस একটা দুটো ইউ নো ইনসিডেন্স দিয়ে যদি আপনার লিডারশিপ ক্যাপাবিলিটি গুলো যদি প্রুফ করতে পারে দেন ইট বিকামস লাইক এ গুড ইউ নো এলওআর এন্ড অ্যাজ আই সেড ইচ এলওআর শুড বি ইউনিক লাইক কমন একটা এলওআর যদি তিন জায়গা থেকে আসে দ্যাস নট গুড এন্ড ডোন্ট ইউজ জেনারিক টার্মস লাইক হি ইজ ভেরি হার্ড ওয়ার্কিং এন্ড অনেস্ট হার্ড ওয়ার্কে কোনো ভ্যালু ইউ আছে না ইটস অল अबाउट ইউ নো কমপ্লিটিং স্টাফ বাই দ্য ডেডলাইন এন্ড হাউ স্মার্ট ইউ আর ইন হ্যান্ডলিং অল দ্য স্টাফ এন্ড ইউজুয়ালি এলওআর আপনার এক পেজ হয় টু পেজেস ম্যাক্স এন্ড প্রফেসর যদি এলওআর লেখে তাহলে ইজ দ্য বেস্ট and now you can you know look at my sample errors and try to write it yourself and i ekta common jinish jeta kore manush copy paste kore onar error ni jeno ami chalai dai but american universities ja khub bhalo kore jane eta and they maintain a the database so apnar error jodi okhan theke ashe tahole cancel kore dibe so don't just copy and paste others error next okay ekhon apni apply kore felsen ekhon apnar professor shortlist course apnake then you have to give an interview and this is like your chance to shine এখন ইন্টারভিউতে ইয়া লাইক when the word interview comes to your mind আমরা সবাই খুব ভয় পেয়ে যাই লাইক যা কি হবে লাইক আমাকে টেস্ট করবে কিনা বাট ইন্টারভিউস আর ডু নট লাইক ইউ নো টেস্ট ইউ নো whether you are you know talented or আপনি জিনিয়াস কিনা এগুলো টেস্ট করবে না সো ইন মাই কেস হোয়াট হ্যাপেন্ড ইজ লাইক অল দ্য প্রফেসরস আই টক টু দে ওয়ার টকিং अबाउट মাই রিসার্চ অ্যাজ ওয়েল অ্যাজ देयर রিসার্চ লাইক মোর অর লেস এটাই তো তারা যেটা করবে যে আপনি রিসার্চ যেটা করতেছেন এটা আপনি ঠিকমতো বুঝে করছেন কিনা সেটাই আর কি তারা টেস্ট করবে হয়তো কিছু কিছু প্রফেসর খুব কিছু বেসিক কোশ্চেন করতে পারে ফর एग्जांपल মেশিন লার্নিং এই পার্টিকুলার জিনিসটা কি বাট আপনি যদি বুঝে রিসার্চ করেন দেন ইউ শুড বি এবল টু অ্যানসার দ্যাট এন্ড ওরা খুব এক্স্যাক্ট কি কোনো অ্যানসার চায় না সো আমেরিকান দের এটা একটা খুব ভালো টেন্ডেন্সি আমি যেটা অবজার্ভ করছি যে আমরা অ্যাবস্ট্রাক্ট করতে পারি জিনিসগুলো লাইক আপনি ধরেন 50% বা 60% একটা জিনিসের অ্যানসার দিবেন ওরা সেটা অ্যাকসেপ্ট করবে ওকে এন্ড অ্যাজ আই সেড ডোন্ট বি নার্ভাস লাইক দে দে আর গোইং টু টক अबाउट व्हाट ইউ ডিড বেসিক্যালি আই থিংক যদি 45 মিনিটস এর ইন্টারভিউ হয় দেন 35 minutes will be based on the stuff that you did and they're going to ask question you know research question based on those and conferences that the paper publish kore thaken oi same jinish i ghure phere or ask korbe so eta gelo er pore apnake impress korte ki korte hobe obviously ami jeta bollam je apni jodi apnar research ni thik moto kotha bolte paren they'll be pretty happy and then apni hocche tader kaaj niye kichu question korben normally ora kintu expect kore na eta apnake jante je ওরা কি কি করতেছে এটা আপনার ডিটেইলসে জানতে হবে এটা দে ডোন্ট এক্সপেক্ট বাট ইউ ক্যান আস্ক সাম কিন কোশ্চেনস দেখ যদি আপনি তাতে কোশ্চেন করেন দেন দে উইল বি লাইক ওকে দিস স্টুডেন্ট ইজ ইন্টারেস্টেড দেন আই শুড প্রবাবলি ইউ নো ফান্ড হিম এন্ড টেক হিম সো ইন সামারি অফ পার্ট 2 সো ইউ হ্যাভ টু স্টার্ট আর্লি এন্ড ডোন্ট ওয়েট টিল দ্য লাস্ট মোমেন্ট এন্ড দুইটা গ্রুপের লিংক আমি এখানে দিচ্ছি অবভিয়াসলি আই গেস বোথ অফ ইউ আর ইন আই মিন অল অফ ইউ আর ইন দিস গ্রুপ হায়ার স্টাডি অ্যাবর্ড ইন এক্সট্রা ভিউ এসে সো এখানে আপনি অনেক এক্সপার্ট অপিনিয়ন এন্ড হেল্প পাবেন আপনার আপনার যদি কোনো কোশ্চেনস থাকে ইউ ক্যান পোস্ট হিয়ার এজ ওয়েল and arekta jinish jeta ami kori je apni dhoren apply korchen kintu decision ashteche na apni nervous so decision dewa shuru korche kina kibhabe janlen so great cafe nam ekta website ache kintu take a look at that and you can come to website ache kintu also take a look at that as well and apply korar age it's important to keep copies of all your academic transcripts and certificates jodi thake ami amar kache amar certificate chilo na just transcript chilo kichu and amar kache amar ws evaluation kora lage nai top universities usually don't require ws hoyto mid rank ba lower rank university ra chai kichu khetre but টপ ইউনিভার্সিটি লাগে না এন্ড স্ক্যান কপি অফ ট্রান্সক্রিপ্ট দিয়ে আমার অ্যাডমিশন হয়ে গেছে এন্ড আপনি যদি ফার্স্ট ইয়ার বা সেকেন্ড ইয়ারে হন বা থার্ড ইয়ারেও হন ইটস আই থিংক ইটস আ গুড টাইম টু স্টার্ট লিস্টিং আপনি লাইফে কি কি করছেন আপনার অ্যাচিভমেন্টস কি পাবলিকেশনস কি প্রজেক্টস কি 
এটা ক্রোনোলজিক্যাল রেকর্ড রাখার একটা গুড ওয়ে হচ্ছে একটা ওয়েবসাইট সো ট্রাই টু ইউ নো কিপ ইউ নো রেকর্ড অফ হোয়াটএভার ইউ আর ডুইং তাহলে আপনার পরে সাজাইতে সুবিধা হবে সবিতে এন্ড अप्लाई করতে হবে সে ক্রেডিট কার্ডের প্রয়োজন হয় সো ট্রাই টু গেট আ ভিস্টার মাস্টার কার্ড অন এমএক্স অন এ কিবেল এক ওভার ডিএবল ভার্চুয়াল করে বাট আই হ্যাড देयर আর লস অফ প্রবলেমস উইথ দিস আই ডোন্ট নো সো ইটস বেস্ট টু গো উইথ ইউ নো কমন ভেন্ডরস এন্ড ইউএস অ্যাপ্লিকেশন প্রসেস কোন এজেন্সি লাগে না সো ডোন্ট ট্রাই টু লুক ফর এজেন্সি and direct is get a bowl if you get an offer obviously i'm sure of narrative apply like current then offer pavan but try not to accept more than one offer okay onek shomoy dekhi bangladesh era multiple i20s order kore but this is very unethical because i'm the basically seed no stock this direct and over series and so covid 19 related kichu points so fall 20 te onek student jeta somoshya hoyse je student nise kintu student ra aste pare nai ei karone or defer course spring তো সেই কারণে আপনার ফল টোন্টি না একটু কম স্টুডেন্ট নিতে যাবে ইউনিভার্সিটি গুলো আমি যেটা খেয়াল করলাম আমার প্রফেসর সাথে কথা বলে কারণ হচ্ছে স্যার ফান্ডিং এজেন্সি থেকে ফান্ডিং ইস্যুস সো বেসিক্যালি প্রফেসরের ফান্ডিং ইস্যু নাই বাট ফান্ডিং এজেন্সিরই ফান্ডিং ইস্যুস হচ্ছে যেহেতু এখন কোভিড 19 কাজ কম রিসার্চে সে কারণে गवर्नमेंट ফান্ড अप्रूव করতেছে না খুব বেশি এন্ড অবভিয়াসলি রিসেন্টলি তো ভিসা রেস্ট্রিকশনস আছে এই কারণে ও ইউনিভার্সিটিস গুলো আসলে ফরেন স্টুডেন্টস খুব বেশি নিতে যাচ্ছে না এন্ড ক্লাস সাইজ লিমিটও আছে কারণ অনেক স্টুডেন্ট আপনার ডিফার করছে সো সে কারণে সমস্যা সো বেশি সাফার করতেছেন না মিডল লরেন্ট ইউনিভার্সিটি গুলো যেগুলো রিসার্চ আউটপুট কম সো এখন পাঁচ গুলো চ্যানেল লরা একটু বড় ইউনিভার্সিটি দিয়ে করে দিচ্ছে সো বেসিক্যালি যেটা করতে হবে যে আপনি যদি ফল টোন্ট টার্গেট করেন দেন ইউ টু গিভ ইউর বেস্ট শট লাইক আমি যা যা বললাম এই জিনিসগুলো আসলে খুবই দরকার গোছানো এসওপি এসএস ইউ নো অ্যাচিভমেন্টস রিসার্চ এন্ড एवरीथिंग এন্ড ইফ ইউ ফলো মি লাইক ইটস নট ইম্পসিবল লাইক পিপল আর ইউ নো ডুইং অল দিস স্টাফ ওকে এনিওয়ে সো নাও দ্য লাস্ট পার্ট পোস্ট অ্যাপ্লিকেশন মানুষ কমেন্ট করবে ভাই আপনার প্রোফাইল কি ছিল ওগুলোতে ফোকাস না করাই বেস্ট ওকে জাস্ট ট্রাই টু বি ইউর সেলফ দ্যাটস ইট ওকে আর একটা জিনিস ইম্পর্টেন্ট ওরা আপনারা দেখছেন তো রিসেন্টলি সোশ্যাল মিডিয়া লিংকস চাই so try not to you know post stuff that you know proves that you are an idiot on social media okay and you can find my visa interview experience here amni ekhane gele dekhte parben e link e gele je kemon kichu ora ask korene just you know basic questions like ora amar i20 dekhse and they just ask questions like why you coming to us apni ami onek gulo desh visit korchhilam us tar age so they asked like why did you go to turkey and then ora was okay you are good so miscellaneous stuff kichu like apni jodi chance pan so obviously the important stuff that comes to mind is housing flights you know and shopping obviously so housing er khetre jeta ami korchilam seta hocche like um, you know us the jao dui mash age like i started looking for listings in university websites and then ami uh, obviously us the house now shomoy apnake eta deposit korte hobe but deposit korar age ami amar us the friend chilo so tage pathaisilam je ektu je dekhe asho je is it legit or not karon onek shomoy scam scams hoy and location ta khub important housing choose korar shomoy onekei kom khoroshe housing korar jonno onek dure housing nai but ektu like trade off kora ta bhalo okay and shopping bolte jeta hoy je depends on weather obviously la la weather bangladesh er motoi so amar tamon shopping kora lage nai but apni jodi khub cold kono state e jan then obviously cold clothes lagbe but bangladesh er winter clothes use te kaaj kora na so bangladesh theke ashole winter clothes shopping kore niye jao mane but overall apni jodi garments ba utensils nite chan then ogula ashole bangladesh e cheaper but electronics appliances and food items hocche apnar more or less ekhane cheaper and as i said like apni jodi large city te jan then bangladesh e khabar er khub beshi samoshya hobe na you can get you know all the stuff you want to cook everywhere more or less even indian store also indian stores are bought and for flights like ekhon to flights ne tamon kichu bolar nei but fall usually flights cheaper hoy so it's fine and asha like i try to you know get a driver's license if possible because us runs on cars and you will need it okay now the thing is oh, life in the us obviously at any rate my khyal course is not going to be the same as bangladesh so ekhane manush onek independent and they do stuff themselves they cook themselves they clean themselves ami age ranna banana kichu bartam na bashar kono kaj kortam korte bartam na so ekhane eshe ami shikhi and i had a genius jeta khyal rakhte hobe like bangladesh apna kichu hoyle like you know you you could have like had friends they she bolto are samasya nai it will be fine but you are the spirit professional like you have to be very strong like, not strong rakhna khub important 
and like the common genius of if you come here and you will definitely suffer from imposter syndrome because you know I'm under as specialist of business in India Nepal and you know you'll also meet people from China Europe or actually you know or their education system is much better than Bangladesh so they know a lot of stuff so apni actually shuru to shuru the imposter syndrome e bhugben je ami to kichu shikhe ashi nai ki korbo but slowly you'll get over it like yes je apnake shikhabe kibhabe you know e sob jinish handle korte hobe and right as you used to je ta khyal korchi like there's this fast paced work culture like europe e jodi jan europeans are pretty chill but us e to sob man bhoran you know they work for 8 hours continuously you know every day sort of like that you know, obvious and we can say tara kintu khub moja kore we can tara email o check korbe na এই কারণে আপনি দেখবেন যে প্রফেসর যদি উইকেন্ডে ইমেল করেন তাহলে ওরা রিপ্লাই দিবেন বিকজ এত বেশি স্ট্রেস থাকে কাজের আমি বলবো স্ট্রেস বলবো না আমি বলবো যে কাজ করতে করতে আপনি টায়ার্ড হয়ে যাবেন আর কি লাইক ইফ ইউ এনজয় ইওর ওয়ার্ক দ্যাটস ফাইন বাট ইউ উইল বিকাম টায়ার্ড डेफिनेटলি সো উইকেন্ডে আর কি সবাই এনজয় করে এন্ড ইটস নট হার্ড টু টেস্ট বাংলাদেশি কালচার লাইক এখানে ঈদের সময় ঈদ হয় পূজা হয় দেন আই আই কুড বেঙ্গলি ফুড एवरीडे সো ইটস নট दैट मच অফ আ প্রবলেম and cost jodi dhoren tahole cost state to state vary kore in general us is very affordable but large cities like los angeles is expensive but moja jinish hocche l j price dhaka te apni je jinish je dame kinben l the same price but ekhane to earning beshi amader so it's it's a little weird so basically dhaka er price hote se apnar bolte gele us er theke beshi it's kind of like that and yeah i don't want to talk about the current situation currently obviously both political onek kichu hote se like visa restrictions and stuff and i guess you are following the news so. I don't. I don't want to talk about all those stuff. Hopefully, they'll be fine. Yeah. So in general, like for this Shashkori presentation, so you have to work smart, not hard, and try to dream big, and try to you know focus on you know achieving excellence in whatever you do. Don't just aim for mediocrity. Okay. Like, अपने जाइ कोर्बन शेटा दे जाते अपने try to be the best. Okay. And try not to copy someone else. You are unique in your own way, and uniqueness is very important when you are applying for grad studies. Okay. and a link to my sepkoi rakhen you can get all the materials from this link all the slides and all the folders and docs you know that i was sharing okay and okay that's fine and ekhon jodi karo kono questions thake ami question and answer dewa shuru debo shuru korbo okay karo kono questions ache you can type in the chat or you can i guess ager question gulo sob delete hoye geche connection discussion jono so gula abar type korle i guess bhalo hobe uh in that case i can help you by reading the questions okay that will be fine yeah you can start uh, okay uh, the first question is from atikur rahman ahad sir hmm. uh, without jerry uh, he is want he want to go to usa so hmm. should he choose a uh, like a low kind of university low ranking university or not there are two answers to this so firstly am jodi pandemic er kotha chinta kori pandemic e kintu top most university maximum e gre optional kore felse but normally jeta hoy apnar gre kintu more or less required in the us everywhere so gre na diye us e ashta ta it is a little risky karon kamni jodi grad school e aste chan then obviously bhalo grad school e ashben karon grad degree is very important so i mean in short term bolbo je try to sit for the gre ধন্যবাদ আতিকুর রহমান আহাদ স্যারের দ্বিতীয় প্রশ্নটা ছিল জিআরই 2FF এগুলো अप्लाई করার জন্য আমার আসলে কি পরিমাণ টাকা পয়সা দরকার ওকে ইয়া সো এটা আমি যেটা খেয়াল করছি আমার অলমোস্ট ইউ নো 90000 টু 1 লাখের মতো লাগছিল জিআরই টফেল ইউ নো দেন ইউ নো টিকেটস ভিসা অ্যাপ্লিকেশন ফি এগুলো সব মিলাই আর কি তো ইয়া আর কি ওরকম ইটস এক্সপেন্সিভ প্রসেস ইজ আ বিট এক্সপেন্সিভ লাইক 90000 টু 1 লাখ রেডি রাখাটা কি ভালো অবভিয়াসলি আপনার ফি ওভার অপশনসও আছে বাট উই লাইক টু রে আর কি ওকে আই গেস আই হ্যাভ সার পোস্টেড ইন দা চ্যাট সো আমি চ্যাট থেকে পড়ে পড়ে অ্যানসার দেব সো ইজ ইট পসিবল টু সুইচ ফ্রম এভারেজ ইউনি আফটার এমএস টু বেটার ইউনি টু পিএইচডি ইয়া অবভিয়াসলি আ লট অফ পিপল ডু দ্যাট ইটস ভেরি কমন Average duration directly to PhD. MS, MS leading to PhD usually takes five years. So masters two years. So I'm in second year masters. So I'm our masters complete. Kola then after three years, like we PhD got there. Our should do PhD got the four years. Like so one year or more. Come. And it also after actually it actually average. Bolam. I mean it actually vary. Kore. One case is six years, seven years. New MS PhD got there. So one case is five years to complete process. So usually five to five point five years. And then MS to you know, MS and PhD got there. What is the minimum amount of fund uh, one can consider to accept to come to US? Of course, big cities can be costlier. 
student get admission without fund? Yeah. Uh, yeah, cities are expensive, obviously. US is, I mean, little expensive because Bangladesh are not to take a But overall, it's pretty affordable. Like, you know, in, in you know, obviously, LA is expensive. LA time, Bashavar, you know, actual dollars, so that's a lot. But on the state, you know, you can get the same thing for, you know, 300, 200, 300 dollars. So 200, 300 dollars on a K, you know, three bedrooms, apartment device, Erokomo, yes, so. So, minimum amount of funds are there, like, I'm not Public university is one like UCLA, and then UCLA have not tuition could be com. Like it's usually teen mash up around fifteen thousand USD. But what are what are one of hard ways? So it's best like I'm you know eighty to ninety percent fund manage for the bar and then back it up. I can mainly show some tuition remission to the manage for the bar. At least living cost up the catch core to the filter bar, but tuition does that or a math core the eater key like the then ranking of the university to apply. So I already said that. Uh, it doesn't only matter on ranking, it also matters on like where, you know, you have a screen share question? Okay, okay, no problem. Okay, okay. Screen share question. Okay, no problem. No, no, it's fine, it's fine. So ranking of universe, as I said, it's like where to apply. So, I mean, it depends, you know, on all the factors that I discussed, like the lab, I mean, whether you like cold weather or not, then the location, like on the rural area, the survey for the and stuff like that. Unless one has much money, one cannot apply to many units. Yeah, that's true. So how low rank unit will be okay to apply? So yeah, I mean, five, 300 to 500 is fine. 300 to 500 is mid rank unit. On due with the side, due ranking all the thousand. Anything above due is fine. Okay. Some top units offer without GRES for news. Is it true? Yeah, it is true. Like pandemic on a on a KG optional professor. Top unit for promising professors from lower ranked units. Is it good to select a busy professor? Okay. Uh, that's a pretty hard question. In my case, I'm a professor promising busy and he's also the top. But I mean the most funding is available in top ranked units. So I'm not funding me chinta take chinta I mean funding the attention good and it's best to try for top universities, but obviously professors matter because they are ultimately at the end, at the end of like a guide code and Tara Jodi Khara Pai Tele Jinishta to Word Hajar. Minimum CGP, I know case of CGP 3.1 applied and did PhD. Yeah, CGP of three, above three is fine. Yeah, I mean, obviously, J apply Korbe Tara Wana Anu Jinish Patro, Shab Milai Tara Judge Korbe. Then there's another question, is it a good practice to change field for master's after doing thesis in another field? Mm. Yeah, I guess it's fine. A lot of people do it. And Jetta Hoy Abni Judi Master's Quotation again, then your research will evolve anyway. So Tahona Abni we same basic field and ito thakmana. So it's fine. With one publication, or is the opportunity to get admitted in the US top rank? Uh question tech to Bishi Ashole Vegas eh? current should publication there to US judge karana at that profile. So show overall Mila Tara judge karana. Okay. Mm from could I know first I should mail the professor directly because someone says contact the supervisor or someone who maintains this I should yeah you can yeah I'm just, I can website at the hands a professor like Jane if you apply to the university central and a professor best you know then at me which a Jody professor get a mail you know they are going to restriction other then you can start emailing professors then there's another question, is it better, isn't it better to get central admission rather than managing a professor without knowing much about him? The second one is better than how to know which professor will be good for me. Which professor will be good for you? Try to meet him, you know, in conferences or talks or try to look in the website and see research. I think the important thing is that the professor is good grad students that email. So we as grad students, I'm going to email a reply compared to the professor. So you can email us. Okay, to know whether a professor will be good for you or not. Okay. Does study get matter in MS PhD? Does it make difficult to gain fund? Uh, no, not really. If you are doing a job that's relevant, then it's fine. I mean, study gap doesn't matter that much. RA or TA, should it be a concern? I heard people say TA often interferes with study and research. Okay. Thing is, UCLA, if you join UCLA, then you will not get TA in your first year, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> but a lot of other universities do offer TA, and yeah, it's true that TA ship a apnake, hotamanaka course divajet apnar kaje kubishi lagana. So if you love doing research, then I would suggest go for RA, but RA is also a lot of work. So not like a course that Pashavashi research focus on the Jacane, TA the hotamni just slide banalan, discussion nilan, session quarter, and then you are done. But RA is indeed a lot of work, so it depends like what you want to do. 
I mean, TA often interferes with study or research that is uh, not always true. And Jara TA ship kore, Tara kintu Ara ship kore na, by the way. So it's fine. Could you please paste the link of the materials here in the checkbox? Okay, sure, I can do that. Hello. Okay, yeah, okay, chat box the dilam. We shared the tiny URL link in chat, okay. Next question, could you please, okay, done. What about length of SOP? How can you show leadership capabilities? Should LORs only be from professors or will it matter if you get? Yeah, you can get your LOR from employers as well. That's fine, okay. But try to like uh, write it in a way that it's relevant to graduate studies, okay. And how can you show leadership capabilities? So yeah, I mean, for leadership capabilities, obviously in Malad is the most common thing to do is like, you know, get involved with like a organization, for example, IEEE, or, you know, you can also show leadership capabilities, you know, by, you know, doing, you know, winning awards and stuff, you know, and attending contests and stuff. So a good of leadership capabilities, you know, they also sort of tell like what you can do. Length of SOP, SOP depends upon the universities. So usually it's like two pages to three pages. So they will give you like a word limit. And there's this question, how much money will I get if I work as a research assistant and spending the whole month, how much money will I have? This depends upon the state and this depends upon your professor, actually. It's very hard to say. Like, I know on a research assistant, I'm not sure what i but they are in like a very, you know, cheap state. Like, they're cheap to live. But in my case, LA is very expensive to live. So, Amar Kese obviously fund on like, you know, my salary is a lot. But in the end, Amar Khorocho Kubeshi hai. Since LA is a little expensive. So it depends upon the state. But I can assure you that like universities are very sensitive about funding. So they will ensure that you can more or less survive. So don't worry about that. Then can I ask over mic? So this is Javi Bondov. Yeah, you can go over and ask in the mic. What do you want to ask? Um, uh, yeah, yeah, I can listen. Um, our question take to honor of him. বিষয়টা হলো যে আমার এক থেকে দেড় বছরের ভিতরে আমার ফুল ফ্যামিলি আমেরিকা শিফট হওয়ার একটা মানে প্ল্যানে আছে আমাদের মেবি ভিসা মানে পাসপোর্ট এবং মানে গ্রিন কার্ড মেবি আমরা পেয়ে যাব এরকম একটা কথা আমাদের শোনা যাচ্ছে তো এই ক্ষেত্রে স্যার আমি উইদাউট জিআরই তে সেই দেশের সিটিজেনশিপ হয়ে যাচ্ছে মানে হয়ে যাওয়ার পসিবিলিটিস আছে স্যার সেই ক্ষেত্রে স্যার আমার কি কি ক্রাইটেরিয়া স্যার মানে জিআরই সাথে তো সিটিজেনশিপের কোনো রিলেশন নাই আসলে না আমি আমি এখন ফোর্থ ইয়ার স্টুডেন্ট রয়েতে আছি ওকে আমি চাচ্ছি যে মাস্টার্স কন্টিনিউ করব মানে আমার প্ল্যান ছিল যে নরমাল ওয়েতে মানে আমি যাব বাট আমার এখন একটা মানে ফ্যামিলি থেকে অপরচুনিটিস আসছে যে এইভাবে যাওয়ার তো সেই ক্ষেত্রে আমার মানে সবগুলো প্রসেস কি স্যার নরমাল ভাবে করা উচিত নাকি স্যার আমার জন্য কোন কোন আমি এখনো ই আমি যদি এখন কারেন্টলি বলি দেন এখনো তো আপনার ফ্যামিলি যায় নাই সো দে আর নট ইউ এস সিটিজেনস ইয়েট সো ইউ ক্যান अप्लाई নরমালি বাট যেটা डिफरेंट হবে সেটা হচ্ছে আপনাকে ভিসা অ্যাপ্লিকেশনের সময় হয়তো আপনাকে মেনশন করতে হবে যে আপনি গ্রিন কার্ডের জন্য अप्लाई করছেন কিনা তখন ওইটা আর কি মেনশন করে দিতে হয় যে ইয়েস মাই ফ্যামিলি अप्लाइड এন্ড ইয়া দ্যাটস ইট but if you want to apply for the chance then yeah you can do that as well after coming here but yeah that's the thing i mean it, it's not that much different okay amar shop kichu ami jodi or sathe jog kori o bodhe question ta jikish korte chachi erokom je tuition fee er khetre kono advantage pabe ki na oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah. so ei bishoy ta admission er khetre kono preference ba privilege pabe ki na ei bishoy ta bodhe jante chachi actually yeah that's yeah that's a good question so ha hey. So, I'm not sure, you know, international students, so I'm not sure that they're doing that. So, I thought that my resident tuition or a non-resident tuition. So, if you're the American citizen, you have a non-resident tuition, you have to pay for it. So, you have to pay for the professor. And yeah, you have to pay for the domestic student, because you have to pay for the US citizen. So, yeah, if you're like a US citizen, slightly to have priority payment. But recently, I saw that especially in engineering, professor was an American student. It was an American student who was doing a lot of stuff like that. But since you are like from Bangladesh origin, so yeah. I mean, yeah, funding is an advantage that you have to give NRT. And you have to give NRT to the citizens. You have to give NRT to the citizens. You have to give NRT to the limit. You have to give NRT to the domestic and domestic. Okay, next question. 
uh, is it possible to get scholarships or MS only from different scholarships offered by universities and organizations? It's a bit hard, like professor at the fund, but hey, one of the other organization by university take offer us university will actually fellow fellowship with a PhD student by MS to PhD student, MS to form or MS professional degree. To. But yeah, it's, it's a little hard, pure MSA funding. Per. How long an average it takes to complete PhD? I already said around five to five point five years. Or four years for pure PhD, but usually five years like it. Can I know your GPA? Yeah, my GPA. My bachelor's GPA is 3.94. Yeah, my GPA is comic too. And the test is hard, so I can't 3.78. But hopefully, final quarter. Share the URL link. I shared already. Okay. How much money will I get if I work as? Okay, I already answered that. One should apply to how many universities at least, and what should be the percentage of top schools, mid range, and sub schools? So it's like this. So um, if you apply to 10 universities, so Dostarmati, you can have like two or three dream universities, then you can have like, you know, five mid ranked UNIPs, or, you know, more or less good UNIPs, and then last two, you can have like a safety net. So this is more or less how I, you know, tell people to structure. But obviously, Dostar University, that's how I apply to People usually apply to five, so you scale that accordingly. Like, Past other job they apply and then you keep one as dream and then you know two three years more or less okay or safe and then you know last year to check our conference are the article of stranger conferences hosted in really good the answer is obviously no those are not good but for you know undergrad those are fine like economy level lesson those are fine can bangladeshi msg ms degree help getting funding uh, anywhere uh, not that much like I'm just the MS tag that's good. So when I run the MS court, I have a nice answer. But MS not a clog into you know, manush chance for it. I'm the MS thara ashi, so it's fine. How important is it to have indexed paper from Bangladesh? It is very difficult to publish good paper. Uh, that is not necessarily true. It's it it is difficult to you know publish good experiment experimental papers. But if you look at the topmost papers and topmost journals, like or I can to. All the need is just a computer. Maybe you have a GPU machine, but you have to use more or less graphics card. So I wouldn't agree that it's difficult. It's difficult to say that you, I mean, Bangladeshi people don't know how to write papers. That's the thing. So you need to learn how to write papers, good papers, how to learn how to tell stories. That's the thing. What's your GRE score? My GRE score is 330. Question, if I do something not related to study after grad, then after three, four years, will this, be a, uh, will this gap bring difficulties to gain fund? Okay, the answer is no, it's, it doesn't matter. Like the faster you apply, the better, but gap take on the In fact, USA, J. Kalsatra, Ami Kalgorsi, J. Grad school again to manush work experience. So if you look at, you know, all these Indian people who are getting chance, or again to another top company, then or grad school apply for it. So we work experience to run here. Again, our chance by Vishy because they have the, you know, industry experience and everything. So it's fine if we have work experience, it's not a problem. Okay, I guess that's all the questions. So the question that you can, you know, speak over the mic or you can type in the chat. Is there an advantage to do Erasmus Mundus Masters and then go to US for PhD? How long can PhD take in that case? I already said Japan is the master's score, then usually four to five years like it, or the master's score, then five to 5.5 years like it. And advantage, I mean, uh, yeah, I mean, if you have Erasmus Mundus Masters, then obviously the Europe take a master's degree by then obviously that is like far better than getting a master's from another. So, yeah, in that case, there is an advantage, like a bunch of the foreign country take a master's like it. Okay. I guess Arkaro Arkaro Kono questions. So Karajudi Kono uh personal questions take. So what you can do is you can uh email me. So you can uh reach me at this email address and I'm not any questions like if you want to apply to UCLA or you have any questions in general, you can just email me. Okay, that'll be fine. I'll try to reply. That's not a problem. You can type this email. So it's just my first name and middle name at the letter of g.ucla.ad. Okay. I'll just put this in the chat as well. Mm. Copy address. Okay. So 
Shopping, can you share your screen? I stopped my screen share. Yeah, it's fine. Let me send it to everyone. And we are all almost uh, uh, at the end of our session. If you have any question, please ask, or I will uh, go to the end session. There are a uh, few EXCO members of IT for the Computer Society Bangladesh chapter. Uh, here I see Professor Dennis Arantin, sir, Professor Atik, sir, and Mr. Shojit Shah. Sadia is also host of this session. So there are few extra members are there. Okay. Uh, if there is no question, then we will go for uh, any session. Yes, there, there is one last question that someone asked me privately. How did you manage a course on satellite engineering in undergrad? Okay. So, I mean, uh, course Salem, at the end of third year, you know, BRAC launched, you know, the, you know, they were trying to launch the small set. So I got interested in small satellites and I tried to make a prototype myself. So one of my professors noticed it. And Uni Hoche Asia Pacific Space Cooperation Organization member Chilo. So EPSCO is like a consortium of nine countries and they try to, you know, launch satellites and try to promote space education. So he actually like, you know, told me that there's this summer camp that exists and you should probably go. And that's how I managed like, you know, course on satellite engineering. So it's, it's true, like one of my professors. So that's why I said it's important to keep professors by your side. Okay. Okay, I guess one of the questions now. So I guess direct bio, we can move, you know, and do like the ending. Uh, so thank you, Shopnil, for such an informative uh, presentation. And I think the audience have enjoyed the session, also learned a lot of things from you. So before ending our ceremony, uh, I will request Dr. Atiksar to have a talk with the participant. And we also have another uh, XCOM member, Dr. Uh, Shamsul Arifin, sir. Ji, ji, ji. It's okay. I think Atik Bhai is also there. <laughs> Achha, thank you. Thank you. Prathamata hoche je shop nil je eto shundur kore pray eto points eto shundur bhabe present kore chhe amazing ar ki. Ami oke onik dhono bad jana hai abong she on a open, openly bolche the jar joto help lage she kurbe. Definitely, uh, what he presented, uh, ita tar ei por jonto jana experience er upore kora. Kintu ekhane amar obikota uno chare uno deshate chato chate deal kore ba uno no professor deal kore. Ami jeta bojeche she dolo je she mulo to majority of the points se cover korche. Taro jodi ek Connect a topic, a dimotake, bounor comabico take, it a takti pare, can the US the onic boro, onic diversity, abong onic variations takti pare, into sheja present coroche, aminiji, tajo poegesi. I mean just a shurute attend cora chesta curriculum, Jamar Chatro abong prio chatro, sheja to present coroche, ami shuni, kichukon, garnamar barota business. It upon past the se rat ekta, into ami nagumi, purata somoita, kotagula shunlam. আমি চাও আমার মনে হয়েছে যে আমি অনেক কিছু লার্ন করতে পেরেছি পারবো এই প্রত্যাশায় আমি শুনেছি আর কি এবং इट्स ওয়ান্ডারফুল আমি সবকে অসংখ্য অসংখ্য ধন্যবাদ জানাই যে এত সুন্দর করে সবকিছু উপস্থাপন করার জন্য ধন্যবাদ সবাই थैंक यू স্যার সো फ्रॉम আই ট্রিপলি কম্পিউটার সোসাইটি উই थैंक यू অল ফর জয়নিং দিস ওয়েবিনার we are now ending the session. Thank you. And thank you, Shapni. Yeah, no problem. Uh, uh, Professor Arifin, are you there? Hello? Yes, thank you very much. Uh, I have nothing okay, to say. Okay, Professor Atik Arbai already said uh, some words. It's okay, I think, uh, uh, Mr. Asana. Yes, okay, thank, thank you, you uh, to all participants. Uh, we will share the contents and you uh, enjoy everything. 
uh, because uh, <laughs> there are about uh, 100 plus participants are there. So I think this is very much beneficial for us. So in the next time, we will also organize focusing uh, Australia-based admission, uh, European-based admission,